Hello everyone, this is a robot snail. Um, yeah, playing prey. Um, uh, 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 shh. I was not playing. Okay, this music's way too loud. I might have to wait until. Eh, I guess we'll see when it gets there. All right. And then do 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 do. do. It's been a while, huh? <laughs> um, ain't nothing better than playing video games at 12 in the morning. Because I have no idea. I guess. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. Excerpt from Chapter Three of Speech Synthesis and Natural Language Generation by Sebastian Smith. Voice conversion technology enables synthesis systems to generate speech patterns based on their source of entirely new voices, without the need for exhaustive recordings and pre-processing. The quality of the resulting voice depends on the training data as well as the precision of the conversion function and limitations in processing power. See you soon. Oh, listen, I am uh, really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. Except from preface of two hands on electronics by Antoinette So call. By <laughs> working through a series of practical experiments, this humble manual will introduce you to the fundamentals of pro uh, modern analog and digital electronics. By the end, you'll be able to construct any simple circuit. As Thomas Edison once said, to invent, you need a good imagination and a pile of junk. Hello, Morgan. So happy to hear you be coming aboard. Your first official work day is Monday, March 15th. First, we need a series of training exercises. You run with all new employees. Just some stuff to clear you for life in orbit. <sighs> and then... I send a package with everything you need to do. Right. Okay. Where would this Neuromod be? Congrats. Hmm. Shoot, oh shoot, I can't turn that off. Oh well. Wow. Ain't nothing better than getting your socks a little, a little wet, you know? I do that all the time. It's cooling. So... Okay. 
a lot of words. Never mind. Alright, so I must be the guy on the right. So just out of curiosity, where would that neuromod be? There's nothing interesting here. Oh. How could I miss some junk? Morning, Mr. Yu. <clears throat> Heard there's a chopper on the roof. Must be for you. You'll have to take the elevator. Mr. Yu, please make yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. The Transstar stuff. facility is just a short hop. 78 degrees, clear skies all the way. That's a nice view on the bay there. Here we are, Mr. Yu. Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. Welcome, Morgan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. Please confirm. Morgan, fine. Hey, you don't look terrible in a Transtar uniform. How's your eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a you family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good hands. We'll be in orbit next week. I promise. Okay. Mr. Yu, they're ready for your brother in room A. Right. Listen, just be yourself. I'll see you after. Okay. No, I don't want to read. Good morning, Morgan. I'm Dr. Bellamy. Looks like we have some tests to run through today. Probably not the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. All good? Great. Let's begin. 
For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. Oh! Glass one. Wonderful. That's... You're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B, then. Okay, Morgan, listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time, relax, think it over. No, I'm kidding. You only have nine seconds. Hit the red button when you're ready to start. Morgan, we can see you there. Hmm, uh, any synaptic register at all? No? Okay, then how to pass no, that's that fine. Oh, what Sorry, let's keep it. things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. You're doing marvelous. For this test, please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most natural, intuitive way possible, without thinking. Just, just go for it. Press the red button when you're ready. I'm sorry, can someone please explain to me what's happening? Well, Simmons? you see I go from... I installed exactly what button. Tina brought down. There. Did you double check? The speaker's still on. There. Yeah. It's I not that hard. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Not your fault. You're doing fabulous, actually. I know, I One am. One last room. Let's step into D. Okay. Mm Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. Good. Looks like you've got the hang of it. Keep going. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. Good. Next. Almost done. You know what? I'd probably do the same thing. Well done. Well done. We're nearly through it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look at it. Oh, shoot. In oh, a moment, shoot. I'm going that. to ask you what... Uh, is my coffee? It's empty. Oh, my God! Security! Security! Oh no. I don't even know. Hmm. Alex. Simmons, what's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? He's alive. Sedated. <laughs> Clean it up. I'm on my way. Got it. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032.
thousand one. But this door it doesn't even work. love to believe I have like a butler or something. I just can clean up my mess. Because I will gladly we spoke. My code name is January. You're not dreaming. What happened yesterday was real. If you want to know what's going on, She's just tired, first, man. you need to get out of your apartment building. Yeah, You're not safe.
All right, um, let's go up here. What's over here? Oh, the helicopter place. Oh. This could have been like in my. Oh, look, you still see the helicopter. Ugh. That's pretty cool. What if it's just playing mine? can't tell me that like it mimics the organs. That's gross. Alright. <laughs> Jesus. Stop the mimics from multiplying since they broke containment. I'm going to help you stay alive. Just a little further. Forget that, like you—you you know how it, how it is. Um. Oh. I guess it just wanted to give me a whole bunch of stuff, you know. see in the display case. Normally it's a fake, 
but I swapped in a real one for you. The neuromods are critical. You won't survive without using them to install new aptitudes. I've already updated your transcribe with the list you requested. Take a look. Hmm. Let's see. How would I get down? I don't like this. Look, look, who's there? Who's there? So much safer. Oh, my PC's making that noise. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, it's got this. Oh. 
It's trying. I think I might stop soon. Played for a bit of time. I'm tired. You made it. <laughs> Ready for your first real view of the world? No. Not really. And that's it. Yep, that's that's spray. Alright, well see you later.